Antonio, Apparitions in Salerno, Capua, 2003. My son, don't fear for the Asian plague which is spreading all around the world. The plague will spread on the whole planet, causing significant damage. And because of it, many borders will be closed for fear of infection. And the world will know and suffer serious economic crisis. Christians will be forbidden to receive Holy Communion, first in their mouth and then in their hands too. Who has time should strengthen himself now with the body of my son Jesus, because afterwards it will not be possible anymore. Eucharist can be received in two ways, either right in the mouth or right in the hand. First of all, we will see that the Eucharist will not be given straight to the mouth, so they will give it only on the hand. The virus has set off from China to get right away to Italy. The first infected towns have been Cremona, Padua and Piacenza. Let's see this article. Following the provisions issued by Piacenza's prefecture, Regarding the coronavirus alert, the bishop orders as a precautionary measure until further indications the suspension of catechism group activities. For the celebration of Mass, Holy Communion shall be distributed only on the hand Piacenza, February 21st, 2020. Right in the period of maximum contagion due to this pandemic, the prophecy is perfectly fulfilled. They give the Eucharist only on the hand. But Virgin Mary has always expressed her opposition about receiving Eucharist in the hand. Let's see the messages. Apparitions Maracaibo, Venezuela My children, during Holy Mass, at the time of Holy Communion, I ask you to receive the body of my Divine Son directly in the mouth, and if possible, on your knees. Let's see this video. A really mind-blowing event. Professor Magnelli, do you know other cases like this one uh, we've just watched? Or anyway, a case of Eucharist transformation? I wouldn't say really alike because this one is really exceptional. Dr. Magnelli has stated it's an exceptional case. When he gets into the mouth of this Japanese woman, Julia Kim, the particle, turns into body and blood of Christ. In 1996, in Buenos Aires, a particle turns into meat. 
It's been stored in the tabernacle for three years. In 1999, during a biological analysis, scientists are appalled. Inside the meat, there was the presence of white blood cells moving around. That piece of meat was alive. Jesus is alive, true and real, and exists in this world. Let's see. Gospel John While I'm in the world, I'm the light of the world. Giampilieri, Apparitions, Sicily, 2002 Always offer your heart in receiving my body. Do not grab me with your hands. I am nourishment of the soul, not of nature. Manduria, Apparitions, Apuleia, 1995 I tell you that none of you should receive the Divine Majesty while standing. At least genuflect as a sign that you worship me as your King and Savior. You do not receive the treasure in the hands. I am the spiritual bread. Jesus, through Eucharist, gives his light. It's spiritual nourishment, and why shouldn't you pick it up in your hands? Russian scientists, using appropriate instruments, you can search the internet and type down Marina Popovich, they have detected the presence of dark areas on our planet. Writing correspondence with the regions where negative thoughts were produced, like anger, hate, resentment, revenge, frustration, homicidal instincts. For example, right in Iraq where two wars broke out. One in 1991 with the death of about 500,000 children and one in 2003, an awful lot of death. Negative thought produces darkness which we cannot see with our eyes. Let's see the messages. Mount St. Onofrio, Apparitions, Molise, 2013. The seer has seen the Madonna laying her eyes on a vacant chair. Virgin Mary has touched with her index finger the tip of the back of the chair, then turning towards Michelino, who is the seer, with a very sad face, has showed him her index finger, which had turned completely black. 2013. I wanted to show you to what point the sin has come. Just barely touching the tip of the chair, you could have seen how much evil is in this earthly life. The Madonna has touched an object and her finger has turned completely black. Low thought, or let's call it sin, has undermined and sprinkled the world with this dark halo. We can link negative thought to darkness. Jesus, through Eucharist, gives his light. Thought, intelligence, in fact, the Holy Spirit is the spirit of intelligence, which leads to truth, to knowledge. To fulfill the Christic will. And you could tell me, but we see people receiving the communion, but they do not change at all. And you're right. Let's see why. Apparitions, Stefania Caterina, 2012. In order to be united with Christ's sacrifice, it's not enough to attend to Holy Mass, like to a simple ritual which you fulfill because you're forced by religious precepts. If the offer of your life to God and the sincere adherence to His laws are missing, and if your willingness to die and resurrect with Christ is missing too, I tell you, that your rituals are useless. Actually, I tell you that they are an offense to God. I address you, worshippers, who attend casually, but also you, priests and ministers, who often celebrate masses which are not worthy of the name. Repent ye, and mend your ways. On the contrary, when you give yourself completely to God, choosing to do His will beyond everything and everyone, 
here's the will your participation in the Eucharistic celebration becomes active and your being joins fully with Jesus through the Eucharist that you receive. This way also my action in you becomes powerful. Thus you transform little by little until you become yourself living Eucharist. It's God who transforms you, you cannot do it yourselves, because he wishes you to be yourselves an instrument of salvation in his hands, which works in favor of the whole creation. It's been required the willingness to die and resurrect in Christ, that's to say, to get rid of your own convictions, of your own wills, and to put to practice the laws of the gospel. Feed the hungry, give the thirsty drink, visit the convicts, clothe the naked. So, as a result, your Eucharistic participation becomes active because the light of Christ can take effect on the man, transforming him into an instrument of salvation which operates acting according to God's will. Carbonia, Apparition, Sardinia, 2008 Keep yourselves in Jesus' Eucharist. Purify yourselves. Let only Jesus be in your hearts. Only Jesus will. We understood why the Christic light almost never takes effect on men. And why shouldn't you touch it with your hands? Because the dark halo which has surrounded has touched the world, and remember it's been recorded also by Russian scientists, there is the Eucharistic light and body. Let's say the messages. Giulio Tradespine, Apparitions, Rome, also approved by Father Gabriele Amort, 2014. Tell all of my children that I would appreciate it very much if you received me on your knees and in your tongue as an act of reparation with the humility and the love, and if the sacred species of my body were not touched by non-consecrated hands. In fact, St. Thomas Aquinas, one of the best theologians of the Church, has stated The Eucharistic body shall not be touched by nothing which is not consecrated. What is consecrated is the oral body, the chalice, and the hands of the priest. Do not pick up the Eucharist in the hand. Let's get back for a sec to Antonio Salerno's message which I've read earlier. At first they will not give you the Eucharist directly into the mouth. And so it happens and we see it nowadays in churches during the Mass they give Eucharist only on the hand. In a second scenario she had indicated Still, in that message, they will not give you the Eucharist anymore. The Church is moving towards an epochal historical change. They removed the Eucharist. They've been giving it for about 2,000 years. They used to give it even in Nazi times. If everything falls in line during this month, in this period, Virgin Mary should tell us the Church is going towards change, towards its big collapse, and since the host shouldn't be touched with our hands, she should tell us how to receive it. Let's see the messages. Travignano Romano, Apparitions, Rome, 2020 My child, these are the dark times foretold by me. While everyone used to mock you, now they are afraid. I know your difficulties about the Eucharist. And to keep my son Jesus from being outraged, for those will not be allowed to take the communion in the mouth. Equip yourselves with a linen handkerchief, and with it bring the Eucharist to your mouth without touching it with your hands. Store the handkerchief carefully, and always reuse the same one. It's nothing new. In the first centuries after Christ, the first Christian communities always used to put a white consecrated linen on the hand to receive the body of Christ without touching it directly 
on the skin. Right in this period, the Madonna has indicated us how to receive the Eucharist, and not by chance, because as I said before, we are moving towards the change of the Church. Music